everybody, so today I'm doing my monthly favorites for the month of January. Um, I decided that this year I'm going to be a lot more consistent with my monthly favorites. And um, I hopefully think you guys would like this. So um, also I wanted to ask you to please leave me your requests in the comments below because I'm kind of uh, needing some ideas for new videos. So I figured, you know, you're the one who is watching these videos, so I figured you just might have the right to actually decide what would you like to see. So please do not forget to leave me a request in the comments. And now let's go ahead and get into my favorites. So the only skincare product that I have right here is something that I did a whole separate video, so I'm not going to go into that like too much. But this is the Clinique Dramatically Different Moisturizing Gel. So much hype has been going on over this product on YouTube. And honestly, I can totally see why. Um, I've been without it for a week or so um, and my skin was just freaking out it's still recovering from it but I just I just love it so much it's perfect for daytime use for nighttime use for everything and I would totally recommend it but I'm not gonna go too much into it I'm gonna link my video that I did the like haul separately on this product um, in the bottom bar so you can go and check it out if you're interested in more details about it but I've been loving this this month. Next is a product from L'Oreal which I'm not sure if you can get like worldwide. I know you can get it in Europe. It is one of their, this is kind of a dupe for the NYX Jumbo pencils. Um, this is the Color Reach eyeshadow pencil and the color is basically it's a beautiful beautiful gold that's probably not gonna get picked up but I'm gonna do a close-up. Uh, basically this has been a really really good eyeshadow base. It does not crease if anything it makes my eyeshadow, whoops, last a lot longer and I've been absolutely loving this because I usually go, uh, I usually do my makeup like really early in the morning and I need it to last till like very late at night so um, it's kind of good to use something that can really help my makeup last a lot longer and this has been a saver for my eyeshadow. Speaking of eyeshadow this is something that you probably if you were watching my videos this month is something that you probably were expecting to see. This is my Coastal Sense Reveal Palette. Absolutely love it. The colors are so freaking pigmented. Like, look at this. Insane. Um, I've been absolutely loving this for any kind of look, really. If I wanted to, uh, it, look, it doesn't even go off. Um, if I wanted my makeup to look a bit more dramatic, I would use it. If I wanted it to look totally natural, if I wanted matte shades, shimmering shades, glittering shades, this is the palette that I went to and also the brush that I ordered with it, this is just their blending brush. So amazing, like all of the brushes are good but this in particular is just so perfect. It really, if you want more color it can pack on the color, if you want less it can really kind of blend it out, you know, make it nice and soft and hazy and I don't know, I just, I've been loving it so, so much and I've done a lot of tutor tutorials using this palette that I'm going to link, I'm going to link all of them in the bottom bar so you can go and check it out if you're interested, but overall this is just a fabulous, fabulous palette. Another Coastal Sense palette that I've been loving, and no, I'm not sponsored to say this, is their 10 color blush palette, um, also used in some of my tutorials. This has a really good variety of um, colors, you know, for any skin tone. But what I've been loving is using some of the lighter shades to apply it all over my cheeks and then some of the like hotter shades to apply it right to the apples of my cheeks. And it looks so natural and healthy and flushed and I just, I love this. I, I, I just love it. But also I've been very excited about springtime. I'm definitely like getting into the whole spirit. So I've been also loving this lipstick from MAC which is one of their uh, Sheen Supreme formulas in Happy Hibiscus. It's a very pale, pale, pale pink, and it feels gorgeous. I don't think you're going to see it now. Um, it's a really pale pink, but it looks so great on. It really looks kind of happy, and it can be a bit too pale, but honestly, if you just apply it the right way, you know, blend it out and cheer it a bit, it can look so gorgeous, and I've been loving this for the month of January, and I'm probably going to wear it like all through summer and spring. Um, just because it is more of a summery shade, but you know, when you're in the January blues, I feel like this is a great color to have. And my last favorite for this month has been the Revlon Lip Gloss. Um, it's the color... Nude Luster. I think this has a different name if you live in America, which I'm gonna put an annotation right here, what's the name of it in America. 
but the formula is so great I have it on right now and I think it's the perfect like nude pinkish natural color lip gloss which is perfect for me for school for everything it feels very moisturizing on the lips and I've been wearing this most days um, if I'm just you know running around school and you know doing my own stuff um, I feel like this has been a really really good product and I would totally recommend this formula because it feels so freaking comfortable on the lips because it's not very sticky at all and it still lasts a long time so definitely the Revlon lip glosses are very good for not a lot of money so I've been loving this as well. So guys that's it for my January favorites. Please tell me in the comments also what are your favorites for this month and if you're a new viewer just show your support by subscribing and giving this video a thumbs up please and uh, if you'd like you can follow me on Twitter and Instagram all of my links are gonna be in the bottom bar along with the whole list of my favorites for this month and I'll talk to you guys soon in my next video bye